three young men and a teen facing a Cook County judge this afternoon. The four suspects are accused of assaulting and robbing a person on a CTA train Saturday. But in court today, new details emerging. The suspects described as Venezuelan migrants. WGN's Julian Cruz is live at the Layton Criminal Courts building with details. Julian. Well, hey guys, three of the four Venezuelan asylum seekers already facing misdemeanor retail theft charges, according to court records, but now facing much more serious felony charges of robbery and aggravated assault. Based on details released in circuit court today, the four suspects identified to be asylum seekers, all four individuals facing the same set of criminal charges, one felony count of robbery and aggravated battery by strangulation. The suspects are identified as 20-year-old Carlos Carreño Carreño, 18-year-old Yanir Guasmacare Garcia, 21-year-old Wilker Gutierrez Sierra and 22-year-old Fernando Loyal Rodriguez. Chicago police arresting the four men Saturday night on the 2000 block of South Pulaski Road. Investigators say the suspects battered a 49-year-old CTA rider as he was on board a CTA train near the 2000 block of South Costner Avenue to make matters worse for the suspects. Today's judge calling the robbery an act of violence, the 49-year-old victim strangled by one of the migrants, according to investigators, the victim entirely losing consciousness as the suspects robbed him. Fortunately, it appears that the victim has recovered from his ordeal. Now, three of the four suspects will remain behind bars, according to this Cook County judge, awaiting a trial date. If convicted on the felony robbery and assault charges, uh, immigration experts say three of the four could be looking at the future, future possibility of deportation. At the Criminal Courts Building, Julian Cruz, WGN News.